Hello, aunties and uncles, cousins. <laughs> I should just say hello, everybody who's watching. We are going to show you a gift that Frankie got from Auntie Sarah. And Auntie Sarah feels really bad, Frankie, that you're getting this in July when it was a Christmas present. But I told her not to worry, that it doesn't matter, because Frankie, it doesn't worry. We're not worried about it having... Oh, I'm just scratched from the thing. We're not worried, are we, about having Christmas paper in July? Say it's fun! No, Auntie Sarah was a bit concerned because Frankie didn't get a present from Auntie Sarah at Christmas. Because it's this big, great big box, Frankie. And Auntie Sarah couldn't find a box to fit it in. I know, because it's so big, isn't it? So Auntie Sarah and Auntie Emily and all of our cousins, don't worry. Say, we don't mind. Frankie is pretty easygoing like her mum, so. She's just lucky she's getting one now and nobody else is. Isn't that right, Frankie? See, everything comes to those who wait. Oh, and we would also like to thank Auntie Gail in the outbacks of Australia for sending us, well, linking us to a recipe for a sourdough that she uses and um, pancakes. I'm not pancakes, crackers. We didn't try crackers, but I did look it up and we've come across pancakes instead, Auntie. But I'm sure Russ would like the sourdough crackers. So, you know, we'll get a little bit further on in our um, sourdough. Maybe, maybe not. Oh my God, I didn't realise sourdough making was just so much involved. <laughs> now I understand why it costs so much a loaf round here in our artisan bakers. So, yeah, Frankie, I'm going to get that. But I just want to thank Auntie Gail as well, because we've just had pancakes, haven't we? No worry, yummy, yummy, yummy. Pancakes for afternoon snack with milk. Well, I've got coffee, you've got milk. So, Fluffy's not feeling too good. He is lying on the sofa. And he is definitely not feeling too good, because he's not even bothering to come over here and look and see what's going on. <laughs> so, let's move. Let's move the sourdough stuff out of the way there. So, we're going to open this big bad boy. See what's inside, and then um, Auntie Sarah gave us this bag, and I haven't looked inside there yet, so we are going to see. I do know that there's, I think that I know there's definitely one thing that I'm expecting from Sarah that she very, very kindly let us have. I'm so excited to see that. And then there's other things that are in there as well. So let's get to this then, Frankie. That's it. You do it there, look. Mama just make a hole for you. That's it. Ready? Pull that. Pull, 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 pull. No, no, don't pull it off you. No, no. Ah! Oh, my goodness. I think this might be something that you wanted at Christmas. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> yeah, I'll turn around so you can see. I'll turn around so you can see. We can't take your hat, hat off because the sun's in there. Sun's in there, hang on. Wow, I know she is so pretty. Cloud E Sky, she's called. She's a la la loopsie, everybody. Look at her. She's a la la loopsie, and she's got her little doggy with her. So magical, so cute. Yeah, I wish mummy could sew. A la la loopsie, too. And she's got a little pet. Oh, look, she's got a open here. This is where we open her behind. Ah, I see. It says gently open flap. Can you see that? It says up here, gently open flap. So you pull down the flap and then it says assemble play. Let's have a look then. Oh, look at the little handle even. Wow, Frankie, this is so cute. So open here. I do it. Yeah, it is a bit stiff actually. We don't want you don't want to break out, I know. That's one thing about Frankie, she's very conscientious. She doesn't like breaking anything. So it'd be mum's fault if it breaks, wouldn't it? And we all know mum is a bit more heavy handed. <laughs> Let's get it down there. Oh wow, it's so exciting! Say it's so exciting, thank you, Sarah. Whoop! Woo! What is that? 
La La Lupsy Cloudy Sky. It's a, the Assemble the Playhouse. So you put this back up, I think, and then you push it underneath that flap. And then can you see it's got like a, a rainbow and a cloud? And it's got something there. I don't really know what that is, Frankie. And then it has got this other thing here. Do you want to have a look at that when Mummy gets the... Oh, it says it looks like it's 10 pieces in there. I think there are 10 pieces in there. You can have a look in there then and have a look and see to that. You can't stop looking at... Uh, uh, I know, I know. Look at all those things Mum's got to go do now. There are all of the things at the back. Do not remove. Do not remove. Okay, it says do not remove. So let's just do all of these bits then. Isn't she wonderful, Frankie? She is so cute. So mummy finished adding the bits. So she's got a cloudy, cloudy balcony. She has got a little home for her little pet. And then I think you, you keep the box and you can link all of the boxes together. And um, she's got a really cute little halo. So she's final, even though it... Like looks like she's made out of um, fabric that she's been sewn together. That's what it looks like. So Frankie is now going to go off and wants to watch a thing on Netflix. La la loopsy on Netflix. So um, we'll have to find that. But we'll just give Timothy a minute, all right, before we do that. I'm going to show everybody else what um, Auntie Sarah gave me in the bag. And then she's got... Lovely little um, sparkly dress on. It's very pretty, isn't it? She's got wings. I wonder if they glow in the dark because they're very fluorescent. Um, that's not the word. Very shiny. I don't know. Um, and she's got little socks and little shoes on. Should we just show you your aunties and your cousins? Look. Look what I got. She's so cute. She's very cute and she's very, very bendable. Woo! Very, very heavy. She's even got like a little pretend button look on her on the back there. She's very cute, isn't she, Frankie? Yay! Thank you very much, Auntie Sarah and her little doggy. Is there a watching? <laughs> watching. I mean, she got a sister look called Breezy Sky. <laughs> You get all of these in this collection. <laughs> Aren't they cute? And then on the back you get silly hair ones. Princess party ones. And celebration ones. Oh, that's a little one. Oh, these are little ones here. Teacup hearts. 
we knew last week. <laughs> she is very, very cute, Frankie. You're a very, very lucky girl. So whilst Frankie is playing with the La Luzzi, cloudy sky, <laughs> we can show aunties what we got. So yesterday I did, oh, milk. <laughs> Frankie, I thought you drunk all your milk. That's teach mummy for not looking, won't it? Silly old mum. Silly old mum, I teach your mum for not looking. <laughs> Oh dear, oh dear. And he's got a milky seat. Yeah, so yesterday um, I did a TK Maxx. I, um, I showed you the trip to TK Maxx that I did on Monday with um, jeans and our haul. So there's a few bits still there that are. We need to organise together in a little bundle, in a little package. We also have another um, Happy Mail, which I won't open in this video. I don't really like opening Happy Mails together because I don't want one to outshine another. I've done it before and then I, after I've uploaded it, I've instantly regretted it. So I shall be opening that Mandy in another video, if you don't mind. Um, and got a box there that's got the posted to Sam for Ben. Yes, Ben is already teething. Ben is a big boy. He is a hungry boy. And um, I still haven't shown you what I got on my holidays. <laughs> hey, I'm a bit behind in videos because I was so tired. <laughs> that was the problem. Anyway, Auntie Sarah gave us this bag here. So I'm going to... Um, I have not looked inside it yet, so we're going to be opening it and looking in it together. I'll just put you a bit taller up. Let's just get Mandy's gift out of the way. I started to open it, Mandy's um, mail that she sent me, and then uh, I was like, what have I ordered? Because I've been ordering stuff for the baby shower. I was like, oh, what have I ordered? And um, then I see Mandy's name on the back, so I haven't looked inside Mandy. I literally folded it back over. Um, ready. So you are now on a tripod and you've got a leg in the way, so I'm going to try to manoeuvre you a little bit. There we go. Hopefully this will be okay. Okay. Oh yeah, I know this one. So this is, um, look at this. This is a, a tank top, we call them here in the UK. Um, it is very much like a 1940s theme really cute so it's john lewis size 12 to 18 months and it'll fit um toby that's really cute i do know about that cause sarah just washed it when and when she arrived it hadn't dried in time so <laughs> she was like you need to put that somewhere because that has not dried yet oh this is pretty oh pretty dress Look at that, pink and brown um, and cream. It's got a little bit of peach in there. It's got a nice bit of ruching here, color. John Lewis, six to nine months. God, I haven't been to John Lewis for absolutely ages. It's needle cord. I knew it would have a, a um, petticoat. And it's buttoned all the way down. Lovely for dressing the little ones. So easy to dress in those. Oh, this looks nice. What's this? Oh, shorts. Oh, look at these little shorts. Red, white and blue. They are so cute. They're so thin and light. Beautiful. So they are by... Dashing and dainty. Um, I can't see a size, but I'm assuming that it will be somewhere. Oh, yes, I can here. M and Co. 12 to 18 months. Oh, isn't that cute? Sarah has some toddlers. And Sarah actually is the lady that bought Elliot. Adopted Elliot from us. So 
so the, that's why it was also nice to finally meet up. Wow, this is a big bag of things in here. Goodness me. Oh, tiny, a little pair of dungarees. It says tiny there, look, with a little, I don't know. I don't want to say it's a teddy bear. Tiny, it says, it's got wording on it here, and it says tiny, little, small, little, little, small, tiny, little, tiny, 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 tiny. <laughs> That's so cute. New baby up to £10. Oh, and it's even got on the back, look, tiny. <laughs> they are dungarees that will fit my little man. Little James. Oh, they're so cute. That is a teddy bear sitting back to front. Oh, I wonder what that was. It's a teddy bear and it's in um, nice colour. Nice beige colour. Oh, look at that. Baby grow. It says, Mummy thinks I'm out of this world. Sorry, I keep whacking the leg here. I can't turn you around because that's the way the camera is. What does this say? That's so cute. Newborn. Matterland newborn. Oh, Mummy thinks I'm out of this world. That's so sweet. And then a blue stripy dress or top. Nine to 12 months. And it's got ruching around the top here. This is pink. Got this lovely ruche around the top and capped sleeves. Very nice, very nice. And Sarah said, anything you don't want, you pass it along. Oh, did it come with these shorts? Oh, I think it might come with those. Did it come with these shorts? I think it might be with these shorts. Might be, because they're both nine to 12 months. So they're like, um, like bubble shorts, maybe, because that does look like a top. And these are like bubble shorts in pink and white stripe. And then they've got the navy trim, and this is navy, the dress, I don't know. Oh, this is gorgeous too. Another absolutely gorgeous, stunning dress. Look at that. Wow. And it's got layers underneath it. Look at those layers, wow. Wow, what size is this? Mamas and Papas, six to nine months. Oh, I must say, Emma Jane would love those. <laughs> um, that would probably not fit her around the arms and that. Oh, it's lovely. It's So it's like a beige like background. And then it's got all flowers all over it. In navy. And kind of like... um. It's not yellow. That is not yellow. Um, but gosh, I don't know what colour. Someone else can figure that out for me. Tell you what, it'd be nice in, in uh, um, autumn with um, a roll neck underneath. It is absolutely it's gorgeous. Buttons down the back. Um, opera, opch, opera. Remember what? You always help me out in the comments, though. <laughs> you always help me out in the comments. Oh, my goodness. Little bird. She said I said the little bird in there for you. I love li the little bird is a modern take on 70s, st 70s style and colouring. And that is six to nine months. Look at that. That's so cute. Oh, look at that. Play outside, dance every day, look for all rainbows, always be kind, just be you. A little bird came out and was sold at Mother Care. Ah, it's a lovely, lovely, bright coloured romper. I love it. Oh. An original vintage Beatrix Potter card. Ah, this is what Sarah was telling me about as well. 
Um, she found this lady and she has some vintage playing cards and this is one and then she mounts them and puts them on greetings cards. Look at that! Thank you so so much! I'm going to actually bless somebody else with this if you don't mind Sarah. I know a very lovely lady that also likes Peter Rabbit who's my godson's mummy. So over here is the box with the um, thing I bought in yesterday that I showed you in the, in the video in TK Mac, from TK Maxx yesterday. So if you don't mind, Sarah, I'm going to bless that mummy with that, that card as well. Oh, because I am truly blessed by everybody. And uh, I know that uh, Sam will love that too. Oh my God, look at these little dungarees. Little Jean dungarees with a little onesie underneath. Oh, oh, and they're, um, they are stretchy, stretchy material. So yes, be careful of these. Sarah says she's washed everything, she said, but there is something dark in there. So I'm assuming it's this. And she said, please, please, please be careful. Still maintain. <laughs> Um, vigilance, new baby, my little James. Oh, so I will, don't worry. Ah, look at these. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, look at them. 1970s, genuine dungarees. Oh, they're so cute. Thank you so, so much, Sarah. I did offer to give Sarah pay for these. Are these the ones, these are the only thing I knew that Sarah was giving me, I believe. Yeah. I think that was the only thing Sarah, wasn't it? I believe. There might have been something else. But anyway, I um, I did offer to pay for them, but she was like, no, you can have them. And I'm oh, Sarah, that's so kind of you. Thank you so, so much. They're so stinking cute. <laughs> I will take them um, next weekend when I go to the um, Prams and Dolls event at um, Chatham Docks. I think I will take them, even though I do have an outfit for Toby. Um, maybe he can change into them later on. I mean, if it's like it is um, at the moment, it's really muggy, warm, close. So he definitely will want his shorts on. <laughs> this is cute as well. Oh, look at this. So soft, six to nine months from two, and it says chilled. Oh, it's a body body warmer. I call them over here, or a gilet. Uh, body warmer sounds less pretentious. I might want to show you the inside of it. I'll probably there we go. Yeah, look. So it's sweatshirt material inside, it feels slightly padded, but that hood is divine, so soft. It's absolutely beautiful. Thank you so, so much. Oh yes, I there was, I remember now, Sarah. Yes, 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 there was. Little shoes, look at these. These are genuine walk right little shoes. I cannot believe she's gifted them to me. <gasps> look at them. He can wear these even because I don't have him in any shoes, even though his, his theme is orange. Well, to match the um, oh my god, my brain is just not where I'm <laughs> Syndico. But um, yeah, he can wear these dandy steps made in the UK. So three, oh my goodness. She said they might be a little bit tight because they're a little bit tight on Verity. Verity is her Raya sculpt as well. Um, but he'll be okay to wear them for a day. <laughs> they're so cute. Look at them. How many buckles? How many buckles they do? Goodness me, that takes some patience sitting there while your mum does their work, doesn't it? <laughs> Well, Auntie Sarah, thank you so, so much for blessing us. This is a wonderful, wonderful gift. And 
and um, I still haven't got to the nursery. So, you know, I still got to tidy up the nursery yet. <laughs> so it is a big, big thank you from Frankie, Mummy, and all of the other one, littles that are going to benefit from this, Auntie. Thank you so, so much. Everybody is so loving and generous to us. So, yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, you want to say another thank you? She says, thank you very much. You don't see me very often because I don't really like it on the camera. But thank you very much, Auntie Sarah and Auntie Emily and all my cousins. You are so kind. See you in the next video, everybody. Bye.